Um, we're going to go down this little trail here. We are in search of the Rockland Furnace, and there are a couple of runs that go along with it. Sawmill Furnace. Come on, let's go explore it. It's your first time here. Thank you for stopping in. If you've been here before and you came back to see another video, thank you so much for coming back. Give me a like, a share, a comment. Please, thank you. Where? There she is. Can you see her back there? Can you see her? There's Rustic. There she is. Yeah, there should be, from what they say. Anyhow, not only are we going to search for the Rockland Furnace, and we will find it. Don't worry. We're good. I've got a nose and Kathy's got the eyes, we're good. But Freedom Falls is just up here too. We're gonna scope that out. Look at all the scrapes on these rocks. Vehicles used to come down this way. See that? It's so nice out here. It was so in the middle of nowhere, really. Nowhere. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, that is. That is, it's right down there. Hmm. Well, that wasn't too bad. I really should have brought the other camera for this, but I'm not going to worry about it. These falls are nice, but it's not a big spectacular picture falls. They're only about 20 feet high. One side is more or less a slide, and the other side is a drop-off. So we're going to work our way down here and get down there. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Nice thought. Oh yeah. Maybe I should have brought the other camera too. <laughs> oh well, you'll have that. Ooh. Oh yeah. Very nice. Can you imagine just having a picnic sitting down there on one of those rocks? Oh that is nice. Look at that, it's like a little, I don't know, like a little cave down there, so dark and... The water's not very heavy, we didn't have much rain lately. Could you imagine that with, after a good heavy rain? Mm. I was not planning on coming down to the bottom of the falls, but I did because the furnace is right over there. I mean, it's like right there. It's not a hundred yards like they say. Isn't that gorgeous? Now this path is just a tiny bit sketchy. So pardon me for being a little bouncy. Anyhow, this Rockland Furnace was built in 1832. Oh my gosh. It was built by Andrew McCaslin and was in operation until 1854. And here it sits. Okay. Fall down, go boom. We're good. Now, it's near the Allegheny River. And it's kind of in the middle of a forest, as you can see. But we're going to get there in just two seconds. It was the ideal location to produce iron. I'm going to go up there. It might be a little better. Good Lord, look at that. Now, according to some old maps, which I have not found for two reasons. I didn't know about them till recently. And um, I didn't have the time to research. This furnace might be the only remaining evidence of a town called Freedom, Pennsylvania, which, of course, lends its name to the furnace and that waterfall. Look at this. You can see the falls up there. And, wow, look at these mountains alongside of this river, creek. Here's the furnace. 
Wow. So cool. So amazing. 1832. And here it is, still standing. Showing some wear and tear, but it's still standing. So, let's go check it out. Now, these are two of the runs that they used to divert water from the creek to use this for the mill and furnace. This is one of them. I'm not going to get down in there because it's that's as high as me. It would be too hard to get out. Kathy would have to like lift me out. And then here's another one. This is just crazy how it's still standing here after even when the creek floods and you know how they wash everything away when it floods. And it's still here. The stones are still good. Let me step over this thing without killing myself. All right, there we go. I'll get down here for perspective to see how high it is. Sorry for the jiggly. Sorry about that. Look at this. This is just about shoulder height for me. It comes out here. And then that one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Very cool. The way they used to divert the water for this. Some trees fell down. Very cool. Okay, there's Kathy. So look at all the nice little, those are trees, aren't they? Trees and ferns growing in the side of it. it no wonder fun. it's starting to crumble. No, it's all right. We're good. People are used to us chit-chatting. <laughs> they know we're both a little off our rockers. <laughs> I'm leaving that in there just for the fun of it. Hey, we have fun when we explore. All right. Whoa. I... I'm going to go closer up there. See if I can peek up that... The chute. I'm not going to crawl under those rocks. God, if they fell, I'm done. Totally done, but I'm going to put the camera up there. Hold on. There you go. We are looking up the chute. I see a little bit of light coming out of there. I'm not sure what you can see, but I am not crawling up in there. First of all, because of the bugs. Second of all, because these rocks look like they're ready to go. Okay. That was me trying to look up in there. Not sure of what you were able to see. Oh, there's a side here. Look at that. That's bigger. Much bigger. That's where the light was coming from. It wasn't coming from straight up above. That's all caved in. Look at this. Wow, we got more cave in. And the mosquitoes are like, got off. Whoa! Very cool. Hold on. All right. You could actually get up in here. I'm not going to touch anything, though, because it's so sketchy. I'm going to turn you upside down, see if you can see up there, okay? Here we go. What can you see up there? What can you see up there? Can you see anything? I can see light coming down. I'm sure you see something up there. I'm going to put you up here again with a different setting on the camera, see if we can see anything better. Here we are. We're going in the guts of the furnace, in the main tube. There we are. Can you see anything? I can see light coming down. Can you see any light? Hmm? Anything? Oh, who are you talking to? Were you talking to me? No, I was talking to myself. Thank you for coming to see the furnace and the falls. That was like really cool and nice. And it's a really, really nice area. It's not as hard to get down to as they proclaim it to be. You just need to watch your footing. Anyhow, hope to see you soon. Peace, baby.